hi all i hope you are doing well so today we will start with xcode programming so this is our very first hello world program or that is a ritual program that every coder makes when they start with their new programming language so this is how your xcode screen will look in playground okay so how you have to open when you can select xcode and here in file just you have to click over this playground and when you will click over just name your playground and you are here on the playground screen this is your first program by default the xcode provides so we will just erase whatever they have given us by default and then we will just make up a very simple print statement that says hello world to swift simple so now what you can do just click over this blue and it will run and you can just see it is running build succeed and here you can see hello world to swift why i am asking you to go for the first in playground and not to go in any other app as of now like in any other xcode application in xcode when you will open up and even explore you will see like there are many platforms xcode will give you like ios development in ios development you have to make a app you have to make an interface you have to make so on and so forth so just go and first open up xcode playground why because it is the most basic thing a person can learn over here because it's the basic platform that help you to run swift because first we will need to learn the swift programming language and when we have our hands on on swift programming language then only we will be able to create or build apps so in order to learn swift i think playground is very easy because here you can see each and everything that is happening here you can see down below your output and over your right hand side this pan shows you like which line gave this output like which line is giving which output okay so like it's like a behind the scenes like behind the scenes this line is giving you the output let me make it more clear let's take a variable a which stores 5 as the value simple and clear if i put enter then what you can see um let's run this line also you can see behind the scene also it gave me like okay 5 has been initialize you can see here 5 has been written so you can just go over and you can see acha 5 has been given out here a simple easy program okay so now if i also print this variable a again so what will happen you can just simply see so you will get a as been printed okay here a value has been printed but how you can see because a value was been given 5 so you can just have a behind the scenes what's happening behind this code like why a was been printed 5 why because here you can see it was been initialized to 5 and was it initialized to 5 you have to confirm it here you can see in the background okay so that's why we use simple playground in order to see because when in future we will be dealing with the for loop while loop iterative statements then you will be able to see more clearly like which statement ran for which amount of time or which how many number of time so there you can see okay it's showing 5 and you wanted that statement to run around 10 times so that you can get the output at 10 times but here you can see oh it ran only 5 times that's why i'm getting the incorrect output so here at the behind the scenes when you can see you will be able to relate things very easily so this is how we use playground for swift later in the next videos i will tell you about more swift concepts till then stay tuned to the channel and thank you for watching the video